day is definitely a day I'm going to remember for the rest of my life. One hour later. Ugh. Hey guys, so I am in LA because I'm attending Los Angeles Comic Con and I'm gonna be meeting up with some friends while I'm here. These are friends that I made back at San Diego Comic Con and I just thought it'd be cool to meet up with them because it's been a while since then. But yeah, it's gonna be a pretty fun and chill and exciting weekend for me here in LA. A pretty eventful vlog, I guess. I'll see you guys there at the convention. What's up, what's up, what's up? Howdy. Hey, you guys, good? Look your seat for Bro, you're gonna... What's up, bro? Yeah. So, we just arrived. My friend Dom. How you That's Wally. Hey. Is this all our, like, our first time? Uh, yeah. yeah. Oh, you first. guys, you guys have never been? We've only been to San Diego. Oh, only San Diego? Yeah. Wait, is this your leftover, Dom? It seems we have. I don't know what that is. <laughs> what is that? We have know. some. We have some fries in the corner. What are you excited for the most, Wally? I'm just. I'm excited for the merch, bro. <laughs> I'm excited I for see, the merch. I'm excited. I want to see what they have. Like, oh, that's what though. I love posters. So, like, the last one when I go to Comic Con for San Diego, I end up with a fuck ton of posters. Like, I have this. Really oh, is that like in a tradition for you? Yeah. Like, get I, my my room is covered in posters. I always get Funko Pops. That's yeah. my tradition. How about you, Dom? What are you? Looking forward to. Uh, mainly, I want to see. Uh, well, we already got the ticket to see Simu Lu, and then yeah, I'm excited for that. that yeah. yeah, I got the ticket to see Giancarlo Esposito. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Amy Jo Johnson. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, does it matter which line we go? All right, yes, sir. We are in. Wally, show off your badge. Going down. Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. Look at Wally. He's such a child. I'm so excited. I just picked up my first badge. I was kind of having a hard time finding the South Hall lobby, but I didn't think it'd be that far of a walk from like the other side. I'm trying to get my shopping out of the way on the first day. Just like San Diego, all the stuff is gonna be sold out throughout the rest of the convention. And I'm breathing really hard because it's so far. We've got a little maid cafe over here. I found Dom and Wally. Hi. Man, now we're just you. heading to <laughs> the main uh, hall. Yeah, the main hall. South hall. Yeah, South hall. Where every, basically everything's at. Pretty much, we're just gonna check out like what's over there. He's just here to check out the girls. To be honest. No. <laughs> nah. I, I swear it's not. Swear. It's not like that. I swear it's not. But yeah, basically the other side we were at, that was basically just all like vendors. It was registration, video game, and anime section. Yeah. yeah that. Over here is like. The actual hall. Yeah, this is the actual hall. Bro, there's more. There's more vendors up here. There's way more up here. Okay, this reminds me of SDCC more. Okay, this is the LA Comic Con I saw online. To be honest, for a second, I thought the other side of the convention was what it was.
Wally is the best. I know, darling. I know. Show them what you got me. I like how we're just at like someone else's booth. I mean, they're not here. That's true. They're not here. I'm gonna get unboxing right now. Oh, there we go. This is our film booth, dude. Yeah, bro, Wally, you're such. Bro, you're a G. Wally was nice enough to grab these two art prints for me. Thank you, Wally. You're welcome. I gotta put this one back in. Thank you. <laughs> you're welcome. Let me go. Okay. So that is a wrap on LA Comic Con. Shit, you can't see it. Day one. That's amazing. Got posters. I'm hungry as shit. I want food. Same, I got a bunch of same here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at all that shit you bought. I just got a bunch of posters. <laughs> yeah, the top look, part look, ripped. That, that shit broke. Yeah. The handles broke. This is some weak ass plastic. <laughs> Forward to tomorrow. I'm excited for tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there's a lot more going on tomorrow. For now, dinner. For yeah. now, dinner. All right, we'll see you guys tomorrow for day two. <laughs> I just want one. Can I get one with you after? Just getting footage for the for the video. Nice. Thank you guys. Alright. You said you wrapped it in radish for me? Are you coming for you? They keep my tongue wrapped. Don't look at it. I didn't do that. Okay. So I just got back from dinner. Uh, I just thought I'd show you guys what I bought. This, which is a 10 inch, no, six inch, six inch, Hero 6 Baymax Funko Pop. To get this specific uh, Funko Pop from one of the vendors. I saw it for a really good price at this one booth. So, uh, sorry. So I said, why not? Shout out to Wally for getting these two prints for me. A Teen Titans. And then I also got this Aang custom print. Uh, shout out, I forgot uh, how to say his name. Next, uh, this has to be the silliest purchase I made this year. A rice bag plush. And it's actually like a life-size rice bag, which is crazy. Yeah, anyways, that is everything I got today. Uh, a really good first day of uh, LA Comic Con. Can't wait to go back tomorrow and meet Simu. Very, very excited for that. And to be in cosplay and to just see all the other Marvel cosplayers. It's gonna be an amazing time. I just can't wait to, you know, just vibe with everyone and, you know, just see all the cool cosplays. The next day. Good morning. Day two. Wally. Good morning. Dom. Howdy. In my Shang-Chi cosplay, because I'm gonna be Simu Liu today. One sad part is though, I forgot the Shang-Chi replica necklace that I bought. Anyways, on the way to the convention center now. Peep the RGB cosplay. <laughs> this is gonna be on your gaming setup, bro. See, I'm wearing red. Wally's wearing green. Dom's wearing, wearing blue. orange. We got our breakfast. Shit was $12 for Wally's breakfast. Nothing, bro. We were supposed to eat at a maid at the maid cafe we saw yesterday. Had some pretty whack shit on the menu. It really was, unfortunately. It's pretty whack. All right, let's see how if this is worth the twelve dollars. <laughs> this is worth nine fifty. <laughs>
Yep. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. He's <laughs> <laughs> like, this guy's gonna come to my house. <laughs> 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 Saw some Shang Chi cosplayers as well. Where are the uh, that guy's holding up two rings right oh there. Oh my gosh! Look at this. Look. Here's a little Shang Chi right here. Okay, here we go. Little little Shang Chi. Oh. Here we go. Go ahead. Hi, my name is Reese. Reese? Yeah. And I'm an action figure collector, and I was wondering. Oh, we're we're about to have a great time. My whole career, you're gonna have. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie to you, Reese. I was not cool about it. Um, <laughs> the day that I found out that my action figures had come out in Targets, I uh, I went to six Targets around LA, <laughs> and I texted all of my friends, and they started hitting up Targets. Some of them might be in this audience right now. That way, that's Shout why it was hard for me to find one. Thanks a lot, Simu. You and your friends. I, we <laughs> went and we bought them all, basically. <laughs> No, we were, I mean, it was, it was so much fun, and I have the best friends in the world. We were on this group chat together, and they were, you know, they were like, I'm at the one in Culver City, I'm at the one in Melrose, like, which one are you hitting up? Alright guys, I'm with my friend, Ken. He has a YouTube channel as well. Nerdy Cantonese. Yeah, be sure to check out his videos, they're pretty cool. And we're in line for Simu Lu. Yeah. Yeah. It's crazy, it's crazy, it's a big line. Wish us luck. My feet are already, like, kind of killing me right now. One hour later. Just got done with photo ops with Simu Liu. It was a while. It took a while, but it was worth it. I believe it happened. Yeah, I know. I can't believe it I happened. spoke to him in Mandarin. Oh, did it? Really? Yeah. This is the line for the Bat and the Sun panel. It goes all the way around into that hallway. It, it feels good to finally sit down after standing for like hours. Are you excited to see? What they're about to show? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm vlogging. You're vlogging. <laughs> yeah. Vlog, vlogception. Let me tell you why the White Ranger is gonna beat Scorpion. It was also a very fun panel just because, you know, to see it. Yeah. Oh, no, we were just celebrating the life of who JDF was and, like, you know, how much he cared for his fans. He, he touched a lot of people's hearts, you know. You know, we'll always remember JDF. But, anyways, I don't know, pretty much trying to figure out what else to do. We got one more hour before. Yeah, one more hour before day two ends. Wow. Nice! 
So that is a wrap on day two. I don't know if I'm coming back tomorrow because there's not much for me to do. I come back, I'm gonna be more tempted to buy more stuff. I'm trying to save myself the trouble from being broke, but yeah, this might be my last day, who knows. Alright guys, so after a long day of walking, we are in Koreatown. We are eating at a restaurant called uh, Sumnam Dan. I recommend the Galbi Fin. This is probably my favorite thing here, to be honest. I'm really hungry. I barely ate all day. Nice. Done eating. Definitely recommend that you check out this place. Really good, really good. This guy is gonna head back home. Back to boring yeah. old San Diego. Yeah. Korean food here is like miles better than uh, San Diego. That is the end for day two of LA Comic Con officially. Good way to end the night with some good Korean food. And be sure to subscribe to uh, Ket's channel. I'll leave a link in the description below. Thank you, thank you. Hey guys, I know I just ended off the night, but before I head to bed, I thought I'd show you guys my pickups. I told myself I wouldn't go crazy with my money. I went ahead and got this for myself. I, oh wait, it's backwards. Uh, it's, I got a Legacy uh, Power Rangers uh, White Ranger Tiger Zord. The justified reason for me buying this is because, you know, Jason David Frank passed away almost two weeks ago and my favorite version of Tommy was the White Ranger. I've always wanted a White Ranger Tiger Zord. I just had to get this for myself to, you know, honor JDF. Yeah, I couldn't help it, man. I couldn't, I just, I couldn't resist. I'm excited to open this up and like, you know, mess around with it and put it on the shelf. It's gonna look great with the rest of my collection. Next, I got this from a booth that was uh, taking donations for charity and they said uh, if you just make a donation you can grab any pop you want and then I saw this one I you know Shang-Chi uh, it was going towards a good cause uh, they had this pop that I keep telling myself that I'm gonna buy I just keep putting it off but I guess uh, coming across that booth was a sign that I should just finally pick it up and what do you know I got it well honestly I see the donation as how much I paid for it so I guess I paid $20 for this. This is uh, Shang-Chi's final form at the end of the movie when his dad gives him the rings. But yeah, anyways, on to the next item. It's a physical copy of my photo op with Simu Liu. This thing comes in second place as my favorite uh, pickup from the con. This is for sure, for sure number one because you know i finally got to meet shang chi himself and i'm still pinching myself and i met him and though it was like really really quick since they were just rushing everyone out there as soon as your photo was taken i still like met him which is just crazy to me like uh, i regret not buying an autograph ticket i believe when you do celebrity autographs you kind of have more time to say things to them like how much you love their work and like maybe one day i will and maybe who knows maybe i'll ask him to sign this photo and maybe the funko pop as well yeah, man, it was really a Shang-Chi Comic-Con weekend. Gosh, oh, and I, as you saw in the clip, uh, Simu actually saw me in the crowd said, Oh, uh, he's holding up two rings. Noticed my cosplay. And I was like, no way. I was just like, so, I was just so in awe. Oh my gosh, like, uh, getting to interact with Simu Liu. Like, I've wanted to meet 
Simu for so long now. Now that I finally got to meet him, let alone see him in person, I'm just like really so out of words. Like I can't believe it happened that quick. It feels like I didn't meet him, but at the same time when I look at this photo, but I did, you know what I mean? Today is definitely a day I'm going to remember for the rest of my life. Definitely know for sure this won't be the last time I'll be seeing Simu. Simu is such a great guy, like such a kind and chill dude in person. Like, he's also a Power Ranger fan as well, so that made me like him even more. But yeah guys, those were my pickups for LA Comic Con. I decided that I won't be attending the last day. I don't think there's there's not really anything for me to check out tomorrow, I guess, other than walk around and take pictures and I'm not going to be buying more stuff too because I don't know how I'll be getting home because I, I need money to get home, okay? Tomorrow for day three, LA trip day three specifically, I'm probably just going to like study and do some homework and maybe edit this vlog, but I'm still meeting up with a friend tomorrow maybe to grab like a quick bite and head home after that. LA Comic Con, it's been great. Definitely more chill, more uh, tolerable than SDCC's crowd. Yeah, if you guys are thinking about going to LA Comic Con next year, definitely do it. It's a very, very fun con. See you guys tomorrow for my last day here in LA. And good night. Now that I asked me how I've been